We're back. This is Phil Biedrone here with Ken Sanders. And uh, my question for you is, what is your advice to anyone interested in breaking into show business in Los Angeles? Well, first of all, um, make sure you really have a passion for wanting to be in show business. And I'd say that about any job, whatever it is you're breaking into. Know that that's the thing you want to do. And that's the first, I mean, that's the biggest step. If that's the thing you have the passion for, it's the thing you really want to do, then, then you're going to be able to fight and survive in that business. Um, and and the, the entertainment business is like every other business in this regard. You know, it's, a, it's, it's an ever-changing business. Uh, and you, as an individual, have to have the passion to stick with it, to ride the waves up and down, and to uh, and to know that no matter what, you're 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 going to you're you're going to make it work for yourself. If you've got that attitude, you're, you know that's most of it. Now, the other thing that's you know interesting about show business, and I and I notice this about a lot of people, uh, whether they're actors, whether they're producers, writers, whatever they are in show business. Uh, they they develop not only a tough skin, which is which is good for life in general, but uh, they also develop uh, multiple talents uh, so that they can adapt to the changing uh, uh, environment within the business. I mean, I know people who uh, you know who are writers and photographers, you know, and they they can nurse both skills, so to speak, and 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 monetize those skills. Uh, so it's, it's a great place, uh, this is a great business in which, to, uh, in, in which to use multiple talents. And so maybe one of the most important things I could say is, you know, be prepared to not only uh, hone and perfect the thing that you think you want to do, acting or writing or whatever, but be, but be ready to hone and perfect you know, that second choice thing you might want to do in the business too because you never know uh, doing one, doing that second choice thing might lead to the first choice thing and vice versa, you know, so. Um, for you this was writing and producing. Uh, for me it was writing and producing, uh, but, uh, and, uh, but a lot, you know, before I became uh, a successful writer and producer, uh, I did a lot of other things. I mean, I was a script reader, and uh, I uh, was a development executive. I was a production assistant. I was I was a, little, I was a driver. I, I did a little bit of everything in the business. I mean, I think I probably did just about every crew position except camera, which I'm no good at. You guys are great, but uh, but you know, but just about everything else, editing. I did a little bit of that. You know, I did a little bit of everything, and and then worked my way toward where I wanted to be. Very cool. So your advice would be sort of uh, diversify your talents. Diver that's the word. Diversify, diversify your talent and nurture that uh, diversity. Okay, great. And of course, one thing can lead into another. And often does. Okay. Well, Ken, thank you so much for joining me today. It's been very informative. You bet.